Hello everybody. Hola, como estas? Estad muy bien. <laughs> I hope everybody is well. Thank you guys so much. I love you. Thank you for your love, your likes, your shares, your subscribes. I ask you, as you come in, please hit that thumbs up. Thumbs up. Okay. Let us know. Let people know we're here. Okay. Um, give me a shout out. The comments. I love your comments. I love each and every one of you. You guys are in the bomb.com. Gemini, high vibe and cross watchers for all zodiac signs. Okay. But the, the, I am reading for Gemini, but everybody's welcome. You can take the energy, flip it, reverse it, whatever about past, present, and or future. Family matters, love matters, work matters, however that goes, okay? Um, only take what fits and leave the rest. Don't ever force a situation to fit to make it yours. Give someone else the opportunity to have what they need to have and to heal, okay? Um, or you can take bits and pieces. Some of it, none of it, all of it may resonate. We don't know. But it's okay if it doesn't, okay, sweetheart? Um, Yeah, that's it. Choir, come to the front. Come to the front. Uh, 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 um. One, two, three, oh, T girl, hero, magic and collective. T girl, T girl, T girl, magic and collective. T girl, T girl, magic and collective. Check us out and see what we're about. Ooh, we are Gemini, 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 Gemini. We sing Gemini, 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 Gemini. Gemini, we are Gemini, 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 Gemini. Yay, Gemini. I'm just trying to figure out what we're going to be talking about because the King and Queen of Pentacles came up. Somebody seems like they're in their head. Somebody's frustrated because they tried to travel to you, but they got blocked. I don't know, Gemini. We're going to get into it and see what's going on now, okay? Definitely. Something about your home. This King of Cups. Okay, for you, I don't know who you are, male or female. Just take it however it go. but there is a King of Cups who is either single and abundant or they're watching you, Gemini, be single and abundant. Maybe you work from home for some of you guys. Or this king, excuse me, this king of cups is ending a situation or they're ending some type of marriage to be single and to come towards you, Gemini. They're ending something in a relationship with the queen of pentacles, that's a wife, energy, to come and travel towards you with some good news. Okay? Yeah, they, 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 they looking for you. Or they're looking for your home, or they're looking for your number and communicate to you. They want what is this spirit? What is this her hermit that I see? What's the I mean the hermit energy? The truth. This there's the ending, the truth that somebody ended something with a wife or a marriage, and they want to come and make some type of offer. They maybe want to start off slow. Could be a Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces. King of Cups is Cancer, Scorpio, and Pisces. This man wants to invest in you, Queen of Cups. So they think that you're your, your, you're their counterpart already. Whoever you are, this is a soulmate connection. So somebody left somebody to be with their soulmate, or they want to communicate to their soulmate, or they want to make an offer, or somebody got a tarot reading to find out that you're single and abundant and self-sufficient. And this person now wants to take action to invest in you. Mm, I don't like this because this motherfucker ain't got nothing, boo. Let me tell you who you are, ma'am or sir, sir or ma'am. You're here. You're at the Nine of Pentacles. You get yourself sufficient, abundant, very beautiful, very, very comfortable. I'm hearing that song by, uh, my, what's her name? You make me comfortable with you. Who is that? Leave it in the comments. I feel so comfortable with you. But whoever you are, somebody do feel comfortable. Maybe you make this King of Cups feel comfortable. Okay, I'm getting two different energies now. The King of Cups do want to start off slow. He feels you're his counterpart. He want to take some action. Maybe he was, I don't know, something about him shape-shifting and pretending. Okay? Um, he's stressed the fuck out. 
Oh my God. Now, this could be old, new, or present. I don't know, honey, because somebody is really... Why does them... Let me shuffle this, because I want to know why the Queen of Pentacles keep bringing their ass on out. Okay? They keep coming out of something. Maybe they end in something with a Queen of Pentacles, a wife energy. And they looking at you like a more suitable candidate for them. But see, like I said, this is this person. They want to make an offer. Now, for some of y'all, it could be that they are mature. They are loving. They do take action. But they want to tread lightly because they really want this to work out. They really want this to invest. I don't know. Maybe I heard, um, I'm not just anybody. Doom, doom. Is it my goal? Is it your goal? Sometimes I'm good at good at, but now I'm not, I'm not at, mm. Say yes, I say no, because I really need somebody. Tell me how to, okay, this, let me shuffle, because this, mm-mm. But, like, let me just tell you this, though. They want the Ten of Pentacles with you. They want to invest in you, because they see that they can have something with you. But it looks like they turned their back on you and offered something to somebody else. Okay, that shit didn't work out, but now they want to turn around and offer it to you because somebody's getting out of a marriage they've ended something and i don't know if you spoke some type of truth about an ending or i don't know but they want to invest and they could be traveling to your home or or not There's something about your home somebody there is a third party energy somewhere who possibly traveled to your home to do magic on it a cap why does capricorn devil keep cutting out or somebody that's toxic and somebody's upset and stressed out. Oh, damn. That's deep. This, this narcissist is hang, is in the hangman position because of a betrayal or a backstab. And they wish I heard, I wish I never met her. So this person could be in love with the enemy. But want to are divorcing the enemy and want to come back to you or either divorcing a toxic energy. They're looking at things from another perspective because they turned their back on a two of cups for a toxic energy. Mm. King of Swords did. King of Swords is sad and depressed. Gemini, this could be you. Aquarius, Libra, this could be you. Because somebody ended something with your ass. Don't let this be a repeat of the last reading, Spirit, because we done passed that part. Yes, yeah, somebody mad about a house or a home or a commitment or a marriage. Somebody feels like somebody's upset because they could have worked on a relationship or a marriage or a home with you, but they ended something was very guarded and defensive with you to go to someone who was already in a relationship. That's weird to me. They traveled to somebody who got them to block you and then something with you Gemini high viber cross watcher and work out things with them but they were already in a contractual commitment with somebody else and now this person's figuring it out that you was the earth angel you was the balance one you would have brought the balance you was the one that she would have been working on things with or this person met this person at work or whatever but I'm getting that they should have been working out on things with you okay and having a rebirth with you. But no, instead of working out with you, they ended things with you and became very guarded and defensive against you. Not knowing that this was supposed to heal. You were supposed to move forward or they were supposed to have some structure and discipline and move things to calmer waters. But the narcissist being in their ego, because we got the devil clearly right here. There is a, maybe you have a family member that's a narcissist, or maybe this father is a narcissist, or maybe your baby daddy's a narcissist. Take it how it go. If your boss could be a narcissist, your boss wants to ask you back. So if you got fired, if you worked from home, or whatever the case may be, and you or your boss was a tyrant and they were fought, they tried to fire you, fire you or whatever, they're gonna ask you for your, they're gonna ask you back to work for them. Because you actually made that company. You grew that company or the company doesn't run as good as it did without you. Okay? But somebody's in regret that they cut you out. They didn't see. They they held back. They, they, they held their back their love or they held back their... This person didn't give you what you deserved. Yeah, and they didn't treat you so well either. So God had to turn that wheel forward. 
God had to turn the wheel forward. forward. Since they didn't want to go, then God ain't going to force them. And when God said, okay, and you move forward, this is where we at right here. And somebody all sat and crying over spilled milk over in this five of cups energy. Angry, mad, hostile, like missed out on the opportunity. And you moved on to common waters, Gemini, and you like, hell no. Nah. Yeah, because you realize this person was too confrontational. They had too much chaos and they put you in too much competition or they kept rejecting you. Like, I'm sure you told this person who you are or what you were. You really didn't have to. They saw it. But yet and still, they still rejected you and traveled to someone else and lied about it in secret. Queen of Swords. Now somebody's crying like Jodeci over here. And they all in their head about whatever they done did. Why does Gemini care? I heard Gemini, you don't. Crosswatcher, you don't. You're too busy running an empire and, and taking care of house. Taking care of yourself, self-worth, those around you, and you're resting at your beautiful home or you're just chilling or something like that. Because whoever this boss is or this lover or family member, shit ain't going, shit ain't going good for them. The wheel didn't turn in reverse, okay? And now this King of Wands is pissed off because you seem to be getting this Ace of Pentacles. And we got, a, we got somebody that's in their head about you getting this Ace of Pentacles, Okay, so why is Respucia over here, Spirit? I'm going to call this this energy Respucia because it's a toxic, low vibrational, stanking energy. Now, I don't know. There could be an Aries that want to come to you, though, too, Gemini, High Vibe Cross Watcher. Uh, yeah, an Aries. I'm getting somebody, this Emperor thought whoever this low vibrational Capricorn was or devil energy that they thought they were the love of their life or something like that. But the love of their life, whoever this Capricorn is, they backstabbed and betrayed the shit out of this emperor. Oh, this emperor is in regret. What is this emperor in regret for? That he ain't never, he wish he would have never, ooh. He's in regret over a king of swords? Or there's a king of swords in regret over an emperor or a king? I don't know. We got Gemini, king of swords, Libra, Aquarius, Gemini. Queen of Pentacles, Capricorn, Taurus, or Virgo. Clarifying the Capricorn by this devil energy, or this is just a low toxic vibrational energy. This king, this emperor feels betrayed and backstabbed by this. And I heard that this devil, whoever this low vibrational wife was, was stealing from the emperor. Mmm. Oh, that bitch was stealing, honey. She sure was. Acting like they was working stuff out. I don't know how this goes. Jesus Christ, but they got a call from the bank. <laughs> oh my God, this is crazy. An emperor got a, a husband, got a call from the bank. And I don't know what had happened. Maybe some hotel room receipts or something. Because that's how this emperor found out about this Gemini energy. This Gemini found out about, I don't know. Uh, or they had a... Mm, hold on, y'all. Mm, they celebrated too. They sure did. And that was a tower. They celebrated too soon. Child, I've been getting this now. It's very possible because this is the real world. Somebody probably thought they were sneaking and being deceptive and cheating and they wouldn't get caught. But somebody got caught when they ended up with a baby and some type of uh, parasite. You know? Yeah, they were exposed. And that's when they actually lost. And now the Gemini's have, mm, 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 Gemini, I'm going to get out this energy because this is crazy as fuck. I need y'all to use y'all discernment. Don't be so lusty. I know you the lovers, but love yourself, number one. Somebody thought they was being slick. Somebody's still on the down low, though. They wondering, do you know? Somebody want to come out the closet and tell you they're on the down low or they like, they're in the same sex. Okay. Or for some of y'all, I don't know. Um, they, somebody gonna come out the closet and tell you. Somebody gonna end up. Somebody's gonna have relations with whoever this air sign is, Gemini specifically. Okay, but this Gemini is gonna break it down and tell whoever the other woman is or somebody that they're gay. They're into the same sex. Or they want to be with an empress or their love of their life or something. Somebody's... 
Mm, hold on, y'all. Shocking realization. Okay, so yeah, this Gemini air sign had a shocking realization that this Queen of Pentacles already had a family unit with this Emperor. The Emperor found out. Yeah, this King of Cups. So, what else, Spirit? So, what did this Emperor find out? I believe that right there. Yeah, and that's Gemini, and that's Two of Cups. So, what is this? Oh, over here. So, what is this Emperor? So, what's going on with this Emperor feeling like the Wounded Warrior, honey? Because his he's him ill. This woman, this Capricorn could be tall or short, however it go. But somebody, a woman led this man out into poverty or into sickness. Because whoever this Queen of Pentacles is, they show up as wholesome and nurturing and caring. They show up as the Queen of Cups energy. But really, they the fucking devil. Okay? Mmm. Mm. Damn. And somebody look. Okay, I don't know who this is for. Somebody walked away as well. They was under some type of spell. Um, I don't know who was had this. Was odorous or something like that. Um, mm -hmm. something happened. That's what made this man stop laying with this toxic energy. Cause somebody didn't take care of themselves. They had some type of. I don't know if they, I don't know, honey. It's a lot of bacteria flowing around and shit. Somebody needs to get checked out or they need to get their health together. So, uh, so there's an emperor that walked away. He found out somebody else was creeping and di dipping and dodging in the pond or whatever the case may be. He done walked away. This Capricorn energy trying to hold on and shit because it's causing that person to be imbalanced and stuff. But this Capricorn stressed out or whoever, somebody stressed out, does somebody want to come and make an offer to you? Now, this is weird, and I don't know who is who and what is what, but somebody do, they see you as wish fulfillment. Oh, wow, spirit. Yeah, and whoever this, uh, they, they, they burden, baby. Yeah, they burden and they're waiting for their ships to come in because things are not moving right and they're moving slow. Something about the other woman's under judgment. From this Ace of Pentacles and this air sign to stress the fuck out. So, I mean, at the end of the day, God is dishing karma. God, justice is being served. Um, What else, Holy Spirit? Because we got an emperor that wants to collaborate with you. And then we got a past person that wants to collaborate with you. And tell us about whoever the third party energy was that's sad about people walking away from them or something. What else, Spirit? Because this is a pick me head, but... Or, or a man, however this go. Um, they could be confused or they could be in denial about their sexuality. Oh my God, but this man wants to take... Okay, somebody likes what they like, okay? I'm going to just say they buy. But it, look, make sure that they make a commitment with you. Because this person, whoever this King of Cups is, whoever this... They want... No, I'm not getting a past person. This could be some for some of y'all and fairly new. In a new relationship, this is a boss, an entrepreneur, a CEO, whoever this is. They they have a they've taken a liking to you, this King of Swords. And something about this King of Swords coming in, wanting to rush in, could be an Aquarius. The King of Swords could be the Aquarius. This Aquarius is trying to make up their mind because something about you that makes them happy. They feel whoever this Aquarius, Libra, or Gemini is. Now, they are not a lazy person. This person got a little bit of coin coin, okay? They look at you as the Queen of Pentacles as well, okay? Or maybe they the Queen of Pentacles and they look at you as the page. However it go, this man wants to invest in you. They want to take a leap of faith with you, even though they could be part of the LGBTQIA community. And this could be an air sign, an Aquarius specifically. Don't have to be. But this Aquarius low-key child they want to take a leap of faith and work something out with you because this Aquarius is high key low key obsessed with your ass period damn Gemini and then we got somebody else in the background that's so I don't know if these are two lovers fighting for you in the ethers in the energetic realm and then one of them feel backstabbed and betrayed by you walking away to be able to be with some a star or somebody that's healing or going to be with your wish fulfillment it's got somebody mentally entrapped about that because you could be on the spotlight or something like that. Somebody doing something for clout or somebody feel bad because the way you're successful or the way that you're celebrated. You could be some type of hermit energy, very wise. Somebody could be depressed, drinking heavily, 
because of a rebirth, because you're getting a new start, a fresh start, and somebody's in the Nine of Swords, Gemini. Yeah. About this Ten of Pentacles, this work. Somebody's stressed out about some, oh, damn. I don't know who did magic on you, girls and boys. Somebody's stressed the fuck out because somebody's going through a backfire from whatever work. Are we in the new moon cycle? Child, by the time this full moon comes, something's about to implode. Oh, Lord, have mercy. Ooh, but you protected, baby. Somebody tried to do something on this moon cycle to fuck your shit up, but baby, you was a little ancestor said, I wish a bitch would. I wish they would. You too protected. Your chakras is too balanced and you too high vibrational for anybody to try to bring or tear you down. Yeah, they think they was like, because they feel hurt people hurt people. Yeah, your ancestors said, I wish I bitch would. And they tried to have the nerves to do this in secret, but they secretly didn't know that you was protected and your emotions are always balanced. You're an alchemist. Your ancestors protect you at all costs. You, the brand must be protected at all costs. That's what spirits say. And somebody's sitting here watching your protect. Yes, yeah, somebody like, oh my God. They can't believe it. They they see, they, child, they know you protected and covered by God. This person ain't, they dumb, but they ain't that damn dumb. Okay? Yeah, they had us in the clouds talking about, I wish they needed, they want to come travel to, Gemini, I don't know who this is, want to come travel to you to have a one night stand to open up the cycle again or even close something a cycle, they all in their head about it. They should move forward because they they need a little bit more discipline. They want to know, do you know about what they did or what they did? Child, they... You, mm, uh, this could be a Leo or a Sagittarius, but somebody laid with somebody and ended up ill. They want to know, do you know High Priestess? Because they want to make a love offer. They swear that they're going to be single and faithful to you this time. They're not going anywhere. They want to invest. They want to give you their love. I, I promise this time. They really mad because this is an impulsive person though. You really can't trust them. We got the seven of swords up here heavy. Like damn, and the ten of swords. So this person is like kind of like, oh, sorry, Gemini. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Okay, Gemini, I'm back. And it seems like somebody's trying to do some type of sex magic i mean no come back to me some type of love spell that's what it is i'm getting somebody's trying to do a love spell on you okay this this whoever this is to get you to invest in them to get you to come back to them they're doing something in on the moon cycles possibly this full moon or they did something on the new moon and they are in depression or stressed out or anxiety because the spell that they're doing is like i said earlier it's not working. You're too protected. You're a too high vibe. You're too aligned. And they automatically know that you're still going to walk away. Regardless of the situation. You've took your emotions and your feelings out of, out, out of the situation. And they're pissed. But that's oh well. Oh hell well. Okay. It was a faded event and the wheel has turned. And because you're balanced out your yin and your yang. You're dark and your light. Now you have forward movement. While this person is confused still. Okay? Yeah, magician in reverse. Okay? Yeah, they're, because of their, their tricks, their manipulation, the magic's not working. And they even went to people to get it done. And, it, and it's just not, it's a no. Queen of Swords. Yeah, somebody trying to force your hand, Queen of Swords, or King of Swords, to um give them another chance, but it's a no. So that's where we're at with that, Gemini, High Vibe, Cross Watcher. I hope that helped. But um, I did keep kind of interrupted when I the, uh, I heard some noise outside the door, so I wanted to check that shit out. But anyway, you're getting karma and you're getting some type of rebirth. Are you getting you ending something and getting a Ten of Pentacles and a new, a new life or a new beginning or a new spouse? That's their karma as well, to see you get into another relationship and be balanced out and get your wish fulfillment. Oh, wow. Okay, Gemini. Well, that's been your reading. Anything else, Holy Spirit? Before I end it, because my mind did kind of leave a little bit. Yeah, somebody's very defensive and guarded. And somebody is literally upset. Yeah, this magic's not working. That's all it keeps repeating itself. They want to apologize. They want to work like it's a no. 
They, they this person maybe is repeating because this person ain't listening. They're not learning. Or maybe it's you, Gemini, but somebody needs to learn a lesson and let go and let God and let the will turn and let bygones be bygones and let the faded events take place and stop trying to stop shit. Because it's only causing you a tower, whoever this is. Because Gemini High Vibe Cross Watcher, they healing, they're balanced, they're getting married or they're getting, in, they're getting this Ten of Pentacles or somebody else is taking a leap of faith with them. But then there is somebody else that feels dumb as hell. That they took a leap of faith with the toxic queen of pentacles okay and the queen of pentacles was sitting there spreading her juices and fluids all around honey and that's where the tower came up so now somebody feeling some kind of way but that ain't got nothing to do with you baby let people get their karma played out don't take people back from the past we don't know what the hell is going on you know, just because they got bad karma and towers going on and everything like that and you growing and healing and protected don't let them come back and fuck up your shit with their low vibrational ass. Okay, Gemini High Vibe Cross Watcher, male or female. Okay, whoever this person is, mm -mm, they're trash. I don't care if they do have money, if they don't, whatever they are, the way that they move, this is trash. This man is trash or this woman is trash. Look, already tied to somebody. So if there is an Aries somewhere that got burnt, crunched, and clapped from a Capricorn, or a Capricorn got burnt, crunched, and clapped, or Aquarius got burnt, crunched, and clapped from a Capricorn, or Taurus or Virgo, however they go. But somebody ain't doing well, but they, they angry with you, Gemini, because they missed out on some shit. But whoever this is, they on the down low and they hiding their sexuality. And I don't know who that is, but you you do, you know, Gemini. You know Cross Watcher, and you've been warned to stay away because they've been doing work on you, and you know exactly who it is. <sighs> okay, Gemini, my love. Anything else, Holy Spirit? No. Spirit say, yeah, somebody's trying to secretly cause a, a fight or conflict and chaos or secretly put you in competition, and they want to apologize. Well, but, no. Everything is a lie. Somebody is just too low vibrational. You cannot trust this person, whoever you are. You can't trust it. Not at all. They're a traveling hoe. They are a traveling hoe. And they, they're they mentally entrapped. And they drink a lot. And it's just a lot. They hold back from you to go sleep with the same sex, whoever they are, male or female. They go to parties or clubs or child... Uh, and they get it in. However they get it in with whoever they get it in. And then come back and mix fluids and juices with you. No, Gemini. It's a hell no. Okay. Y'all stay safe in them streets. Protect yourself. Leave the past in the past. Leave narcissists where they're at. They're going to come back and say they healed though. Or they're going to come back and say that you make them heal. Or they can only heal with you or something dumb. Don't fall for it, Gemini. Please don't. They done messed up their life and don't let them mess up yours either. Okay, baby? So, that's where we're at with that. And I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day. Talk to you soon. Bye.